Hey there everybody, Arlo's here from Ice Games, bringing you episode 99 of my Star Wars The Old Republic Trooper Let's Play with Zeti here. Uh, still on Rishi, about to actually uh, do the Flashpoint Blood Hunt, which I'm actually really excited about. Flashpoints are a ton of fun, and I'm, I kind of wish there was more solo ones. There's, there's a decent amount of solo ones. There can always be more, right? Maybe you can make, uh, I mean, if I go to solo... I mean, these are all the solo flashpoints, and then if you go to, like, group and stuff like that, um, flashpoints, filter, there's, like, 22 in total, so, you know, we can always use it with a few more, but, uh, maybe, maybe someday they'll do that, but, uh, either way, let's go over some of the comments from last episode, I just want to, guys, want to thank you guys again for all the comments, you guys were letting me know if you're watching, uh, the trooper, the, uh, uh, oh, the Assassin Let's Play, and some, someone let me know, uh, a Ped 3, that you're watching all five of my Let's Plays. Thank you so much for that. But uh, let's go here. So Master Chief Destroyer left a couple comments saying that um, you're currently watching The Trooper, but you will watch will watch The Sith Assassin as well. So thank you for that. I'm glad you like the Star Wars stuff. Uh, and you guys know there is more Star Wars stuff coming soon. Uh, I'm hoping to possibly uh, next week have some whoop, uh, new uh, Star Wars stuff out for you guys. I think that'd be pretty awesome um you also let me know that uh when you get a computer you'll probably join me uh when you get to the level hey if you if you guys are in star wars republic no matter what level you are in or or whatnot just let me know i definitely make a new character or i could even go uh with these characters into smaller or into lesser known areas to, to join you guys there so definitely when you uh get back into the game master chief destroyer let me know i definitely uh love doing some leveling with you that'd be a lot of fun uh, and as mentioned, a pet three, you're saying you're watch all five episodes. Uh, so again, thank you so much for the support. That really, really does mean a lot. Uh, I'm glad you're enjoying all the content. Uh, hopefully you enjoy the new stuff too coming out. Uh, let me know what you think about it too. Um, you also let, reminded me that there's two more episodes for episode 100. So 88, 90 now, and then episode 100 is going to be next episode. So I might do something a little bit different. I might steer away from the, uh, story mode uh, for a little while to figure out what uh, what I could do. If you guys have any suggestions, so let me know down below. And uh, I'd love to hear from you guys. What do you guys think I should be doing? Maybe you could do some. Maybe I can actually try to do an operation. Maybe I could do some uh, adventuring around a stronghold. Uh, maybe even do some like uh, PvP or Starfighter or something like that. Let me know what you guys like to see. Do a little bit of a special episode for 100. Uh, and Iris the Dragon Master. Uh, said you're perfectly fine with uh, me reading the comments. Thank you guys. I, I've, I've always wondered that if you guys were like, ah, oh, it's so boring watching watching me read the comments and stuff like that. But uh, uh, I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. Um, and then you mentioned that as my as my channel grows and I get more and more and more comments, um, it's going to take up more and more time. So I don't want don't want it. I'm already stretched. Pretty much sometimes I go further than I than I would like to with uh, intros and stuff like that. But uh, when I do do that, you made a good suggestion of maybe doing a video like at the end of the week or something like that where I, I just do all the comments. So I might might do that if I end up getting a bunch of comments on videos, uh, which hopefully I do. I love hearing from you guys again. Uh, I might end up doing like um, uh, once or twice a week, maybe one for Guild Wars, one for Star Wars, where I do like a, a comment video or just just uh just go with the comments and maybe do some flashes to where you guys uh do timestamps and stuff like that in the video i think that'd be a lot of fun let me know you guys think about that again and a uh, thank you uh again iris dragon master a ped three and master chief destroyer for awesome comments keep them coming i love hearing from you guys but uh let's continue on with uh this one bloop, bloop. into talk to fraud uh mac macora of course, we're going to do a story version of this. Actually, what do we get rewards for doing this? Get a belt, which is probably... Oh, it's matching the color of everything like that. Is there a way to turn off unification of colors from here? I don't think so. Darn, that'd be actually be a good thing to add to, uh, to that. But again, some credits. Uh, extra command points because we do have the 200% uh, command point boost going on right now and some reputation, which uh, I really want to get. So let's head through here to the flashpoint. I'm trying not to get a scratch on your ship here, buddy. 
I know it uh, must be super important to you. But uh, I'm excited for this. Whoop. I love me some flashpoints. All right. Well, clearly that flight went well, <laughs> as you can see. Uh, let's talk to this uh, medical service droid. Do you have anything I can buy from you? Uh, trauma med pack. Is that different than that? It must be. But I noticed they changed it a while ago that, like, all the med packs kind of heal the same anyway. So you don't really need to buy new ones if you're getting them. Um, yeah, nothing else I need from you. Let's keep heading into here. So enter the Flashpoint story mode. So Torch's Flame. The Mandalorian known as Torch may have useful information on the Revenites. It's your mission to reach the Torch's Island and find out everything you can. Complete the Flashpoint. Uh, and having recovered evidence that the Mandalorian clan based on Rishi used to have ties with the Revenites, you've traveled to the clan's island hideaway to find out what they know. While approaching the Mandalorian hideout, your ship has been shot down and is crash landed on the beach. Uh, enter the Mandalorian mandalorian hideout and find torch that is one thing i wish they showed so it mentions if i go here dig a little deeper it'll tell me that my ship is shot down why don't they just have like a little scene where your ship gets shot down i mean that would have been that would have been so awesome if they did something like that especially i mean maybe not if you're doing like the veteran or the other flashpoint because you've done it a bunch of times but if you're doing the story mode i think that'd be that'd be that'd be awesome do a little little intro to the flashpoints but let's head this way Got a bunch of little lizards here, some rats. When well, we got our best friend, Combat Support Droid, back. Hey, Combat Support Droid. Um, Dorn, where'd you go? I got Combat Support Droid with me. Where'd Dorn go? Oh. Uh, Dorn, I can GG you right now. I'm under attack. You coming back? It says I have you here. Yes, please come. All right, we got some of these Mandalorians. They must not want anyone on their uh, their island here at all. Uh, I might dismiss you and bring you back. Just because, yeah, you were... For duty. Thank you, Dorn. Welcome back. Yeah, they must not want anyone on their... on their little island getaway here. I mean, you're definitely not the good guys if you have an island hideout, right? Well, maybe they, maybe they are. You never know. All right, so defeat Cryamela. Uh, I cannot pronounce that. Um, so while searching the island, you find uh, standing your way. Defeat the beast and continue your search of the island. So we've got ourselves a giant. It looks like a giant wampa. So it's the deadly hairball. That's an awesome nickname. I am the deadly hairball. All right, let's deal with you. <laughs> Sorry about that sneeze there, guys. So, Assault Plastique. Uh, Meg Vault. Charge Bolts. Back to Meg Vault again. Let's not throw a car grenade at you. I don't know if that'll do anything, but we might as well try it. Uh, plasma Grenade. Uh, oh, sorry. That was a Sticky Grenade. Plasma Grenade. Assault Plastique again. Oh, we got some Mandalorian friends here. Let's do, do a Mortar Strike on them then. Maybe damage to some of you guys. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Um... Do some healing here, or not some healing, some defensive stuff here. So, uh, you guys take more damage. Okay, this guy, big guy's a little more than halfway done. Deal with some of the smaller Mandalorians. There we go. Thank you, combat support droid, for keeping everybody alive. Make bolt, sort of rated bolt. Ooh, is that more Mandalorians showing up? If it is, okay, let's uh, deal with the Mandalorians here. Ooh, throwing some rocks at us. Don't like that. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's do some healing on myself. Ooh, took him down. All right. What do we get from ya? Ooh, we get ourselves a command flashpoint CXP pack. Excellent. So extra command experience for that, which is great. Uh, let's see what it says here. You vanquished the jungle wampa and survived the Mandalorian ambush. Continue your search on the island for Torch. We're looking for Torch. She's the leader, or they're the leader. I think they said she. She's the leader of the Mandalorians here. So we gotta find, find Torch. Figure out, figure out what they know about the Revenites. I mean, are the Revenites still on 
Rishi are maybe they got bigger plans. Made it inside. Huh. Don't know what you're doing in our compound. But since you're here, let's see what you're made of. Yeah, you're definitely not the good guys if you not only do you have a island lair, you have an island lair in a volcano. Yeah, definitely, definitely not the good guys here. Um, let's see here. So, um, Torches challenge, challenge you're worthy. Prove you're worthy by defeating her three challenges. Let's see here. We got one here, one here, and one here. All right, so let's go. Let's go to this one first. Am I heading the right way? Yeah, must be through here. Let's head through here first. Let's see what we got going on for this challenge. We got here some illumination probe crates. Okay. Get ourselves a little probe. Hello, probe. Are you here to help us? I like when probes are here to help us. Whoop. All right. Uh, don't fall down there. Uh, you can actually see in the map. I'd probably die if I fell down there. Kind of like how it's illuminating the area around, though. That's good. Whoop, we're stuck on a rock. All right, what's our challenge here? Ooh, I'm gonna take a river assassin out. Looks like we just have to fight this boss. I kind of like it how we have. Uh, you can kind of see the light around us. That's pretty awesome. All right, so it looks like this one's just gonna be a boss battle. So, assault plastic, mag bolt, serrated bolt. Let's uh, do some explosive rounds on you also. Whoop. Don't like that. Get out of that. Uh, let's throw a plasma grenade at you. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh, oh! if he knocks back, I don't want to get too close to the edge either. That's a uh, salt plastic. Another mag bolt. Two charge bolts this time. Ooh, you're down. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, that went well. Okay, and our first challenge is done. Yep. So we just have two more challenges left. So they, you literally have this this part of the island just for ch like these are these I'm guessing these three areas just for challenges. That's all they're for. That's um kind of a waste of space, I'd think. I guess maybe with them being Mandalorians, they have to test their Mandalorians before they can join her crew. So I guess it makes sense. Got ourselves a little illumination probe. Kind of cute. Look at you. The lights shining around. Oh, you're leaving us. Bye bye, Illumination Probe. Hey, All right. I was almost up to Mando standards. Good to know. Maybe someday I could become a Mandalorian. Nope, I'm a Republic Trooper. Maybe, oh, maybe she would say something different if you're playing as a bounty hunter. I wonder if that bounty hunter would have a chance to like become a Mandalorian. That would be awesome. That'd be really cool. Um, Nick. Like the moss and stuff. Okay, what do we got in here? Another boss? Whoop! Whoop, 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 whoop. Grassland. Oh, we got a bunch of these guys to fight. Kate, let's, um. Oh boy, there's a bunch of you guys hopping out. This from all over the place. Thankfully, you guys are easy enough to take out. And I get a bunch of credits from you. Click. Oh, the credits. Right. Whoop! Another ambush. Come on, guys. I think that's gonna work. I feel bad taking them all out. I mean, they're just trying to defend their territory here. But can I do what I do? All right, let's get over here. Another ambush, I'm guessing. Come on. Take them all out. Gosh, I love area effect attacks. They're my favorite. I mean, they don't do as much uh, damage in general, but I love how you do damage to your group. There's, you do find lots of groups in this game, so I'm kind of glad you have that. All right, another ambush here. Guess I'm going to have an ambush a few more before we... Probably going to fight a giant one of these. 
the, the Tony Trans. Probably what it's going to be at the end. Alright, alright. Keep going. Whoop, another ambush. Ooh, actually, this has uh, the Cunning Eye. That must be the big boss here. Let's deal with you. Get one strike. Oh, oh. Ah, I'll take the little ones here, why not? Okay. Deal with the Cunning Eye here. How are we doing? Doing all right. Let's uh, put on my reactive shield. Ooh, boss is down already. Excellent. That is the second challenge done. How do I get back? Is there a quick and easy way to get back? Oh. Oh, could I have just walked that way from here? Oh. Well, maybe they, like, broke through the wall there or something like that. Maybe there would have been an easier way to get there. Oh, well. There we go. Well, let's turn on our rocket boost. Rocket boost. And, uh... Oh, we'll lose our little illumination droid. But we'll get another one, I'm guessing, with the next area. These kind of bridges always scare me. Gavard. Okay. G Gavard to you too. I'm guessing it means good job. Okay, let's open up here. Another area here. And what I do really like is... Um, if you guys are watching my Assassin Let's Play at the same time, my Assassin did, I think, these three? So I'm actually doing three different ones. So I wonder if it's randomized or if it's per faction. It's kind of cool. Oh, what do we got here? Crackajaw Stalkers. Okay, well, you guys are going to ambush me. Oh, you're literally just sleeping. Oh, I woke you up. Oh. And now I'm blowing you up. Now I feel extra bad. Oh. Yeah, as if he would not feel the best about taking these guys on. These creatures. And I literally just barged in, woke them up, and killed them. Maybe they're all just sleeping. Maybe I just knocked them out. Can we, can we just pretend I knocked them out? Alright, we got ourselves. Over here. Ooh, I want to be careful just in case they, uh, they push me back and I want to get knocked into a hole and, and get killed. All right. Give me those credits. Oh, there's the boss here. You are... Oh, again, you're just resting. But again, lava, not the good guys. All right, with your strongest of the hunt. Oop, gotta be careful he can knock me back here. Light you on fire. That's assault plastique. Make bolt. Charge bolts. Explosive rounds. There we go. Defeat all of Torch's challenges. Excellent. So I got that. So again, I defeated all the challenges um, on my uh, assassin and my, my uh, trooper here. So that's why I got that legacy thing. So that's a uh, rocket boost here. Yeah, I'm curious if you actually get anything for those um, kind of achievements or if it's just for extra points. It'd be kind of cool if we actually got something for those. Or like if you hit a certain threshold, maybe like a, a vendor would open up or something. That kind of feels kind of Star Wars, the old Republic style, is they maybe open up a vendor. That'd be kind of good. That'd be fun. I'd like that. All right. Let's see what this says here. Does it change? You have defeated the challenges. Return to the hunting lodge to and confront Torch. All right, let's confront Torch here. All right, Torch, let's Done do this. Done very well for yourselves, but you're in the arena now. Meet Joss and Volk, husband and wife, tough as Durasteel, undefeated, and still eager to prove themselves. All right, eager to prove yourselves? Well, I'm going to defeat you. How about that? <laughs> no, you won't. No, you won't. You'll try, and you will fail, like so many people have before you. Why can't I use any of my abilities here? 
<laughs> I love you guys so much. My husband, the pushover. Like they're making fun of each other. Or she's making fun of him at least. What's going on? Well, salt plastic. Make hold out like that rotation. Let's put an electro net on. Nope. <laughs> yeah, she's just like yelling at him the whole time. I love it. Oh, oh, your turn now. Like watching dust gather. I guess, yeah, he gives it back just as much as he gets it. I love that. That's cool. That's the adrenaline rush. Uh, let's get some more charges here. Whoop, whoop. Don't like that. Main bolt. Let's do a serrated bolt on you this time. Let's put on my shield here. Like watching dust gather. Like watching dust gather. I like that. All right. Oh, oh, they opened up the uh, cages here for the animals. I don't like that. Try to take down these guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They're out of charges. That's what's doing it. I keep running out of my um, energy cells. Uh, let's use my super cell clarity. Some charges back. Okay. Take these guys down. Dorn, you okay? Try to heal some, heal Dorn a little bit. There we go. Dorn's up. Uh, I think my combat support droid did most of that healing. Thank you, combat support droid. Right, they're almost down, almost down. So close. Oh, one's down. And the second one. That was something. Think it's time we met. Awesome, we get to meet Torch now. So I did get a command rank up. So I'm gonna see what I get in that uh, chest there. Uh, let's also see what this says. So uh, pursue Torch to the heart of the island hunting lodge. Uh, so I gotta go this way. Yeah, I know. I'm level 24 now. I think I think I gotta wait till like level 100 before you start getting uh, other command tiers. Whoop! Got some more Mandalorians here. Take you guys down. I'm just taking out everyone in the uh, in her uh, her gang here. Some more Mandalorians over here. <laughs> I love how you knock them back with that one, too. Alright. Cool displays for these creatures. I like that. Little holograms. Little hollows, as they call them. Ooh. People up in Carbonite. <laughs> oh, it's like they're not even trying. Man, Mandalorians, Mandalorians are nothing compared to Havoc Squad. I mean, we are the best, best squad in the Republic. If that makes sense. Yeah, if your base looks like that, you're definitely the baddie. Maybe you're the one they call Torch. Shea Visla. That little nickname the locals came up with. Hell if I know why. You recently had a falling out with the Revenites and the Nova Blades. I could use your help. I bet you could. Tell you what. Instead of whatever grand gesture of cooperation you thought might happen here, why don't we try something a little different? 
Been a while since I had a decent challenge. I'm taking this opportunity to show my clan how it's done. Alright. So I'll take you out. I'm guessing the yeah, these panels will move and um, fire will come out from everywhere because I mean we're inside a volcano, so that's kinda what happens. Uh well let's deal with you here. That's uh normal rotation, so I'll stop plastic. Here we go. Mag bolt charge bolts. Try harder. Let's do reactive shield also. And I'm gonna save oh, not like that. Nasty. Uh, let's actually use our rope moment also. Or not? Uh, do a uh, orbital strike here. There we go. Let's light you on fire. Haha, -ha, take that. Uh, force lightning. Because we all know the T's part uh, Sith. I'm gonna force choke here. Oh, oh, don't stand on the lava. Uh, let's do some healing. Actually, let's use our. Healing item here. I want that. That. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We are taking a ton of damage. I do not like that. Keep healing ourselves up. Dorn, you need some healing too. Let's do a med shot here on Dorn. Keep you alive. Um, power cell too. Let's see. I seem to be winning this fight. Just gonna throw it out there. Uh, Shay Vizla, if that's your real name. I'm taking you down. I mean, I'm guessing that is Play your real name. Everyone just calls you. Ooh, grapple droid. Oh, good. Took on the grapple droid. Good, good, good. Oop, get out of this. Get out of this. Let's uh, lightning strike you. Orbital strike again in the middle. You're good. I'm better. Let's light you on fire. Fire. I love how you get these uh, these other abilities here with your legacy. Let's uh, let's like go on fire at the end here too. Come on, you're almost down, almost down. Not bad. All right, victory is mine. Uh, let's grab this Mandalorian case. What do we get? Ooh, ooh, and uh, new codex entry for Shea Vizsla. So from or sorry, few beings in the galaxy have seen as many battlefields as Shea Vizsla. Her list of victories surpass even Mandalor himself, and the personal fortune she's amassed after decades of a top as a top tier mercenary is staggering. The quintessential Mandalorian, uh, Vizsla, is ruthless in battle. Um, she's a uh, Gregarious in close company and utterly dedicated to perfecting her skills in combat. Despite, or perhaps because of, her years of success, Vizsla has taken fewer and fewer, fewer contracts in recent years. Her clan has largely withdrawn from galactic events, sparking rumors that Vizsla has had a falling out with her allies in the Empire, Mandalore, or some other powerful client. Others believe uh, she's simply run out of worthy challenges. Uh, whether the whatever the cause, uh, it's questionable whether such a renowned gun for hire can remain on the sidelines for long. That's interesting that she uh, maybe maybe the one she ran, had a uh, running out with or falling out with would be the uh, Revenites. Maybe that's it. Let's put those down there, and uh, let's see here. So demonstrate your victory by claiming Shave Vizsla's banner, which is over here. Why is it wanting me to fight the Magma? I don't want to fight Magma. Oh, I'm still in combat. Oh, I had the same problem before, too. How am I going to get out of it? Because I broke. I did stealth before. How am I going to get... out of it here? Um, let's see. Is there... I don't have an ability to break combat, do I? Reduce threat. I can't rocket boost away. Um, how am I supposed to do this? Uh, Pulsion round? No. Do I actually just have to like run as far away as I can until I break combat? That might actually be what I have to do. I don't know what to do. Because I mean, I, I can't fight Magma. It's below me. 
Let's just uh, keep running here. Maybe it'll eventually break. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Otherwise, I honestly don't know what I need to do. Stealth scan. No, I won't do anything. Um... Line that will do. Yeah, I'm getting way far away here. Like I'm, I'm essentially heading right to the start of the, the area. Um, think, 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 think. Uh, can I put you on passive or something like that? No, Dorn, that's all right. I'm trying to think if I have any abilities. Nope, still in combat. You know what I'm gonna do? Might not be the smartest idea, but I'm gonna try to jump into this lava over here. Maybe that'll do it if I if I ended up dying. There we go. Yep, that worked. Far enough away. glad that worked okay uh shouldn't have to do that but for some reason it keeps um it has me in combat with the with the, the lava with the magma now that's really really weird hopefully they can fix that sometime let's use that all right let's use the banner now Not bad. Not bad at all. Been a while since someone's given me a fight like that. You should be proud. I can see how you earned your reputation. Likewise. And speaking of earning things, I'd say you've earned a bit of intel for that performance. You were asking about the Revenites, right? We were the ones who hooked them up with the Nova Blades. Even helped them win a scrap or two. Once they started the secret, manipulating all-out war nonsense, I pulled us out. I've had my fill of war. Did the Revenites tell you anything else about their plans? Afraid not. I do know they've got a whole fleet of warships tucked away somewhere on this planet. Never gave me any real details or coordinates, but they're here. If you want to find them and smash them up, more power to you. I liked this place a lot better before they showed up. If you want to join the fight, you'd be welcome. I'll keep it in mind. Pretty sure I've got enough to do around here, though. Let's get you patched up, Vode. I've been going too easy on you! Why don't I feel like she's gonna be a little bit more important later on? Maybe maybe she'll come back uh, during the Revenite campaign. Maybe the Mandalorians will actually help us. That'd be kind of awesome. All right, so let's uh, exit this flashpoint. So finished Torch's Flame. Now that you've spoken with Torch, return to the safe house in Raiders, Raiders Cove and report your findings to Theron Shan and the others. So Theron, we're gonna... We are going to... Let you know that we figured out that uh, the Revenites have a uh, fleet somewhere near the planet. And that's not good, right? It's really not good. I mean, we knew they had some, you know, we know we had, they had some ships. Hopefully it's not too many. Um, so we get some credits, some command points, a thousand command points. Uh, some light side points. So it's, um, oh, and we get ourselves some gears. All right, so let's accept that. Is that? Boop. Um, and then let's head this way. It's rock, rocket boost. I didn't mean to heal. Rocket boost this way and figure out. Machine, no gold, no guild controls this sector. Oh, that's right. I really love to start a guild and start controlling sectors. We can't afford to be so reckless, Jakaro. Losing Theron is bad enough, 
What if we lost you too? Now, now, everyone, stay calm. Queen Lena of Onderon once faced a similar predicament, and her solution was quite creative. Shut up, droid. What's going on? Where's Theron? He was captured. The Nova Blades data listed a Revenite safe house here in town, and when we tried to investigate... <laughs> Theron is the only one the Revenite saw. They may not know about the rest of us. If so, we need to maintain that advantage. If we move quickly, we may be able to catch up before the Revenites disappear again. They already have. Please, this is not the time for reckless heroics. I really think you're all much too worried. They took him alive. That's a good sign. They're probably just torturing him a bit. Maybe doing some interrogation where he could tell them about us. Oh, no. Th that won't be an issue. Theron has several discreet implants to help him ignore pain and chemical manipulation. What if Revan or one of his followers used the Force? Couldn't they read his mind? I've never been able to... Yes, I've tried. I'm sure it's no surprise. Theron's mind is highly ordered, very resolute, probably due to his childhood training by the Jedi. He'll keep our secrets and we will rescue him. But right now, we need to focus and think it all through, just like he would. You're right. We need to stick to the mission. When we find the Revenites, we'll find Theron. Precisely. If we're fortunate, he may even learn a bit about their plans. Now, what did you learn from the Mandalorians? Revan has a hidden fleet here on Rishi. He's preparing for some kind of battle. A hidden fleet? Pirates altering shipping lanes. That's it. They aren't just affecting the shipping lanes, they're also changing Imperial and Republic patrol paths. Revan is trying to draw them into a battle. Here, over Rishi. With his own ships in the mix, both fleets could be devastated. That must be his goal. Weakening both sides so that he can make his own play. We have to find some way to interfere. I know where to find them! <laughs> After they caught Theron, I intercepted their transmissions. After that, triangulating their base was a simple calculation. I completed it almost 87 seconds ago. They're on a small island not far from here. The native Rishi have a trading village on the same island. I'm sure they'd give us comfortable lodging. Then let's go. We need to clean up any trail we might have left here. You go on, we'll meet you shortly. Oh, I used to love cleaning. <laughs> I do love D4. All right, let's grab one of these belts. Except that Republic torch. So we finished uh, finished that torch thing there. Uh, what's this say? Oh, that's really completing the a bunch of times. Oh, maybe I'll do that eventually. Uh, let's see here. So we need to Revenites revealed. So Theron's been captured. We have to go protect or get him back. We need to establish a new base of operations before beginning our search. The native species, the Rishi. Uh, I have a village on the island. Speak their leader. Uh, we can do that. But I think before we do that, I might end this episode here. Yeah, let's end this episode here. But before we do that, I do want to go through and put this belt down here. Um, grab our command points here. See if we. Oh, we might actually. Yeah, another command uh, crate here. So now we're command rank 25. So let's see what we get for these. Let's open this up. Uh, oh, also, before I do that, I believe if I go to currency, command tokens are here. So I might, I've been just dismantling these. I probably shouldn't be doing that. Um, so let's, um, let's not do that anymore. Let's open one here. What do we get? Uh, memoir of unification wars. Cool. Schematic for a helmet. Ooh, a new assault cannon. Let's, uh, see what this looks like. Okay, kind of like a quad cannon. Looks kind of cool. Okay, okay. Uh, command token. And, or five command tokens. And this guy here. Ooh, it's actually better than what I currently have. So let's uh, claim them all. Claim. Let's go to currency here. Yeah, 55. Ah, oh, man, now I feel bad because I've been getting rid of it all. Uh, put you down here. I'm actually going to equip this generator. You have endurance, 190 endurance, 126 power, 
Uh, oh no, I want to keep that one because it's got that power. I do have the extra endurance. Okay, so let's um, equip that. Equip it. Yeah. Equip that. Probably sell you later. You I need to transfer. You go down here. Oh no, just down here. Let's open the next one. See what we get. All right, prisoner dog tags. Ooh, reputation for Republic Fifth Assault Battalion. Ooh, we get a new helmet. Uh, which one? This one. Eternal Commander Mark II helmet. All right, looks okay. Ooh, I kind of like the look of that. That looks kind of cool. Uh, bonus command consumable, and more command tokens. So let's uh, claim all that stuff. Put you down here too. Uh, put you for reputation. Let's grab this. Oh boy, that's a ton of. That's so much. I love that. Okay. Um, and then let's take a look at our reputation. See what we get for there. That. So people of Rishi. Get a little bit more. And the 5th Battalion. Well, we're a newcomer for that. Yeah, a little bit more there. <laughs> All right. So that's going to be it for this episode. The so next episode, we'll uh, travel to where the Revenites are and um, actually fight them and uh, save Theron. So thank you guys so much for watching. Actually, sorry, next episode is going to be my 100th episode. So if you guys have any ideas on anything special you might want to see, I, I might try to think about something not, something extra special to do. So thank you guys so, so, so very much for watching. Don't forget, if you like to see that like subscribe button. If you guys don't like to see that this, this, uh, hit that dislike button too. But I'd love to hear from you guys what you guys are disliking about the channel and what you're liking. I just love hearing from you guys. So leave me down. Leave me something down in the comments below. Uh, that'd be awesome. Also, we got a Discord channel, so make sure you check that out. Uh, I do plan on doing some announcements uh, for the channel in there, uh, mainly for maybe getting together to play with some Star Wars Guild Republic with you guys. Maybe set up a guild. That'd be awesome. Maybe we can save up some money, get a guild ship and stuff too. Oh, that'd be so cool. But either way, guys, thank you so much for watching, and until next time, keep your stick on the ice.